Okay. Um, good morning, my name is Sharita Smith, and today our group is here to discuss with you guys who is better between Kobe Bryant and LeBron James. Before we get started, I would like to ask the audience a couple of questions. Um, what makes a good player for you guys? Like, what do they have to do? Who do they have to know? Like, what makes a good player? Rebounds is basically 
5.77. Um, he's been in the NBA Finals 10 times, if I can remember. Um, he uh, won the NBA Finals five times. He received MVP for Finals twice. He was in that All-Star game 14 times out of his whole 16-year uh, NBA career. Uh, Kobe Bryant, is he's quick, fast. He's a leader. He's a great leader. He makes sure his team get the job done. He's not stingy with the ball. He's just he's great with his skills, and his team need him, and he needs his team to get better. Um, Kobe Bryant has been, he didn't go to college. He uh, came straight out of high school. He... Yeah. Uh, yeah, that's about it. <laughs> Thank you. Based on the statistics and characteristics of both players, LeBron James is the better player. Thank you.
Yeah, Kobe Bryant's bigger, but he's still quick. But with his weight, you know what I'm saying? Uh, Kobe played with, you know, Shaq. Yeah. So. Bryant played Shaq too, though. Yeah. But both, like we said, he didn't win the championship. But it, like we said, if they both were to start at the same time, then that would be a, a fight right there. Who yeah. would really be the better person? On based on not just the years they've been in the league, but as their statistics and their stats, how like what that would bring to Yeah, um, I'm for I don't follow basketball, and I'm for Kobe, but for LeBron people, I will say this: um, you can't say that Kobe's better because of the rings. Because look at his coach; he had Phil Jackson, the guy coached Michael Jordan in the Olympic team. So he's he's probably the best NBA coach there is right now. Right. So you can't say that Kobe's better because of the rings, because who coached that team? Um, LeBron probably coaches his own team himself. So. <laughs> <laughs> and like Kobe relies on his teammates more than like LeBron did. are you talking about because if you're talking about a player Kobe Bryant who has clearly accomplished more than LeBron James has and has had a longer trajectory of a career then how can you say that he's been more successful than or is a better player are you what are you basing it upon well our our basis were upon like numbers like mm -hmm. their average their um goal percentage average their rebounds and their um, shooting average outside the three point line and inside the three point line. But don't they play different positions? I don't yeah, really follow play. basketball that well, but I know yeah. that they if do you play, play different positions. yeah, so they would, one would have more advantage in terms yeah. of averaging points and all that kind of stuff. So you, when you talk about who's the better player, that's almost subjective, but who's the more accomplished player? It's Kobe. It's Kobe. Okay. Play.